Welcome to Olympiad Masters. Today we see Class A Chapter One National Numbers Problems. First problem: Zero is not dash. Options are A Natural Number, B A Whole Number, C An Integer, D A Rational Number. This is a multiple choice question. For multiple choice question, not need a solution. But for understanding purpose, we give a solution here. For the solution of this problem, we should understand the basis of the numbers. What is natural numbers? What is whole numbers? And integers and rational numbers. First, what is natural numbers? Natural numbers are the numbers from one, one to infinity. That is one, two, three, four, five, etc., up to infinity, and the natural numbers. Next to set is the whole number. What is the whole numbers? Whole numbers from uh, uh, natural numbers and zero, zero, one, two, three, four, five, etc., up to infinity are the whole numbers. Again, what is integers? Integers are the positive and negative numbers. Include the positive and negative numbers. Example: minus uh, minus three, minus two, minus one, zero, one, two, three, etc. Up to infinity are the integers. Again, class is the rational numbers. Rational numbers are the numbers in the form of p by q, where q is not equal to Zero. Example: minus one by two, three by two, four by two, etc. Are the rational numbers. The concept of the numbers can be better understood by the use of a number line. First, we see natural numbers. Natural numbers are denoted by n, and the numbers from one to three. Four, five, etc. It's not included. Zero. Next, whole numbers are denoted by W. That's a included zero. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, etc. Integers are denoted by the letter Z. Integers are the positive numbers and the negative numbers. Just includes. Positive and negative numbers under zero. Next, rational numbers. Rational numbers are denoted by the letter Q, where these numbers are the numbers uh, can be represented like P by Q, where Q is equal, not equal to zero. Here we can see the in this number line. In between the numbers zero, one, one, two, two, and three are di uh, divided by divided in two sections. So we can write this uh, these numbers and uh, like one by three here one by three one two by three four by three five by three here seven by three and eight by three. The rational numbers between the two integers is the infinite number of rational numbers are there in between two integers. Answer is option number A, a natural number. Next one, if the additive identity for a rational number is options are A, 1, B, minus 1, C, 0, D, None of this. Additive identity is the number which is added to a particular number. We do not change that number. What is additive identity? Is a number which is added to a particular number. We do not change the particular number. Here we consider the rational number 1 by 2. If 0 is added to 1 by 2, answer is 1 by 2. 
means the number 1 by 2 is not changing. So, the additive identity for a rational number is 0. It's true for any rational number. This additive identity for a rational number is 0. Option number C. 0 is the correct answer. Next one. The reciprocal of a positive rational number is options are A. A positive rational number. B. A negative rational number. C. 0. B. 1. Here is the solution. Numbers take positive rational numbers. Example, rational number. Positive rational number example is equal to plus 2 by 3. Anything positive. So, right number, rational number are here. Okay, take example again 5 by 2. Okay, what is the? Reciprocal of reciprocal. What is the meaning of reciprocal? Reciprocal of number. Of number is the um, changing this denominator to numerator and nominator to denominator. 3 by 2. Okay. 2 by 3. The reciprocal. Uh, reciprocal of 2 by 3 is the 3 by 2. And Reciprocal of 5 by 2 is equal to 2 by 5. Check this also positive. Is it correct? Positive rational numbers, reciprocal of rational numbers, all are positive. So, the option number A, what is option number A? The reciprocal of the positive rational number is a positive rational number is the correct answer the answer is option a a positive rational number the additive inverse of minus 3 by 4 options are a minus 3 by 4 b 1 c 0 b 3 by 4 number is negative 3 by 4 we want to Find the additive inverse. What is the additive inverse? The number which is added to this particular number will get the answer is 0. Then that the number is the additive inverse. Example. Example. Let x is a particular number then if we add if we add y to x will get get 0 okay here x plus y is equal to 0 Here, given minus 3 by 4, which number want to add to get 0? Okay. Then, we will get y is equal to plus 3 by 4. Correct? Minus 3 by 4 plus 3 by 4 is equal to 0. Okay. So, additive inverse of minus 3, minus 3 by 4 is a plus 3 by 4. Same is a, any rational number, the same, same condition is there. Okay. Uh, we can take 1 by 2 a rational number. Then the additive inverse is one minus one by two. Okay. Next answer is option D. Next one. Which of the statements is true? 
options are a natural numbers are associative for addition whole numbers are not associative for addition integers are not associative for addition rational numbers are not associative for addition plus b plus c is equal to a plus b plus c this is the associative property for addition okay for first option natural numbers are associative for addition we check for natural numbers what are the natural numbers natural natural numbers is equal to 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 any three natural number okay natural numbers okay example 5 c1 and 2 okay we substitute this values a here a is equal to 5 b is equal to 7 c is equal to 2 substitute values a is equal to 5 b is equal to 7 plus c 2 that is a is equal to a 5 plus 7 plus 2 here 5 plus 7 is equal to 12 plus 2 okay that is a is equal to 5 plus 9 Here, twelve plus two. Twelve plus two is equal to fourteen. Is equal to five plus nine, also forty. It's true. So, so natural numbers are associative for addition. Addition. A plus B plus C is equal to A plus B plus. Sorry, A plus B plus C. Whole numbers. What is whole numbers? Whole. Whole numbers. Whole numbers is equal to zero, one, two, three, etc., etc. Take any three numbers. Whole numbers. Okay. A is equal to Zero b is equal to five c is equal to two. Substitute these values. A zero plus five plus two is equal to a zero plus b five plus two. That is, is equal to five plus two is equal to zero plus seven. Okay. That is, is equal to seven. Is equal to seven. Seven is equal to seven. It's also true. So, the given statement is not correct. The whole numbers are associative for addition. Take any Three integers. Integers are the numbers lying both side, left hand side and right hand side of the number line. Okay, zero, one, two, three, etc. Minus one, minus two, minus three, etc. Take any three numbers. A is equal to minus five. B is equal to two. C is equal to five. These are all integers. Okay, substitute this for in equation a minus five b two plus five is is equal to minus five plus two plus five. 
that is is equal to here minus 5 plus 2 minus 3 plus 5 here minus 5 plus 7 what is minus 3 plus 5 is equal to 2 what is minus 5 plus 7 is also 2 here we got these two sides uh, LHS and RHS are same so we can tell integers are integers are associative for addition these are associative for addition the given statement is not correct associative for addition check the associative property for addition a plus b plus c is equal to a plus b plus c for rational numbers take three rational numbers Rational numbers are the numbers in the form P by Q where Q not equal to 0. Take any three rational numbers. That is, take A is equal to 1 by 2, B is equal to also 1 by 2, C is also 1 by 2. Um, substitute these values A plus b plus c is equal to a plus b plus c a is equal to 1 by 2 plus b is equal to 1 by 2 plus c is equal to 1 by 2 is equal to 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2 here 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2 1 mean plus 1 by 2 is equal to 1 by 2 plus 1 here, these RHS and LHS are same. So, we can tell rational numbers. Rational numbers. Numbers are associative for, associative for in the, uh, addition. For addition. So, the given statement is not correct answer of the question is which of the following statement is true therefore the answer is option a natural numbers are associative for addition thank you for watching and do subscribe our channel for more videos and if you have any doubts please comment and do not hesitate to contact us for further information about our online classes. Thank you.